And I'm back, so let's see if we can kill some bug people. Because the bug people have screwed with us, they have taken what is ours, they need to die. Whoa. Epic lag. I think it might be the graphics of having to calculate all of that, but in any case... Let's get in there and let's wreak some havoc. It is time now to do some killing. Oh my. Oh my, oh my, oh my. And my money is actually holding in the positive somehow. Which is certainly damn impressive. Torpedoes, good. Alrighty, those are uninhabitable. Those things happen. And we have more stuff here, so actually what we could do is send it to somewhere else, like... Actually, no. You will be on system defense duty. There you go. Half speed. Yeah, it's a bit laggy in the battle, but... Oh, they have a cruiser. Isn't that precious? Yeah, it's really laggy. But the, all their powerful weapons, they're just... Yeah. I mean, look at it. It's just, you know... And look at how the damage is happening. They're getting hit here, and that's where they're actually being damaged. Which is just epic. And this one got damaged. Their front weapon has been fracked up. Just a bit. Because he kind of screwed up. I mean, he kind of punched through the port most shield generator, so this was partially exposed. Sorry if my voice is a bit loud, but this is really loud in my headphones. Yeah, that's... I think I'll need to play on smaller maps in the future or something. This is... really rather laggy. Or wait for them to improve the game. Oh, so many of those cruisers. Or are there... F no, these are frigates, but they still have... What, two or three heavy guns at front? That's still a lot of firepower. I mean... Yeah... The smaller ships... You need... You don't need that much firepower, you just need to make sure that you can... Uh, hit them, no matter which direction they're coming at you from. I mean... The way I see it, I have a pretty decent balance of... Uh, I mean, my ships are made to challenge capital ships, and they just have... You know, point defense systems to take down smaller ships. But capital ships like that... And you can see the goats bombarding the planet in the background, which is just precious. I suppose I may as well go. I think it's more of a graphics thing than anything, this... I'll see if I can turn down the settings for future videos, but... Yeah, this one is blowing. It's gone. This one as well. Enough of dinner, Hull gets cra fucked up and... Stuff dies. It's generally how it goes. Soon now. Bombs, bombs everywhere. I'm just gonna zoom out. Colonists on Okab are still getting killed. That transpires on occasion. Phase on, and this can be now recolonized. Excellent. And we'll just jump on to the next one. Phased ordnance. Yeah, we'll see about some more of those weapons later, but right now...
Our ships are more than good enough. Right, yeah, it's really very laggy. Some of these are actually a bit damaged, and that does happen, but uh, it should be okay. Yeah, it's definitely a graphics thing. It gets better once I zoom out. Yeah, you can see that it's the front left side of the ship, and that's the bit that is actually taking damage. You can see how it actually models it pretty accurately. And they actually have quite a few soldiers there, but luckily we have now have the joys of orbital bombardment to introduce them to requisition, build new requisition build new ships, they're good what, it's for you? the system I just took from the Opteris are you fracking serious? Okay, Opter's interest threatened by human military strength awaiting impact. At this point, I don't even want your technology. Just gonna bomb them into the Stone Age. Seriously. Screw them. Okay, here's something we can do. We can give it more goats. Say, four more. And assign three now and build that fourth one there. And that will be good. So we can all so assign existing ships to formations, which is certainly nice. And oh my god, the lag. Actually, no. You are good, we can send you on to the next one, say, here. Leave the second one, second fleet, here. And that should be good. Oh, yeah, that actually lets them get at the... Let's see if we can rip this one to shreds. How good is your point of fence? Yeah, not easy to hit small ships with those heavy guns, huh? Ah, and those missiles we added for defense are actually working out because they can shoot even as they at targets that are coming at them, even as we are orbiting. Right, so how about... Ah, some free tech. Excellent. Excellent. Yes, just keep bombing it until all of their troops are gone, until everything is gone. And we'll send them to colonize already. Yes, just shoot at my ships, I'm sure that'll help. <laughs> yeah. Those tiny ships might not do a lot of damage, but if there's a lot of them, it mounts up. I think they might actually be using armor on their ships, but actually, we can check that out. Like this, and yes, they are. Yep, that's us punching through. We can use the overlay, which I can turn on with tab. Yes, just shoot it up. Oh, stuff got blown in there, huh? Those were bombays. 
I think they had a reactor breach or something. Oh, if we can reach that core and blow that reactor. Oh, sweet mother of God. Then that sh I mean, look at it. They have all those... They have all those weapons on the... I mean, they have all those reactors in sequence there. If we reach those... Oh, we're punching through the armor. Come on. Just pummel it. Pummel it. Boom. Yes. Hit that weak spot. Come on. Oh, heavy front guns, eh? Nasty, nasty, nasty. Let's take a closer look. Yes, here in the center, that's where they have their heavy weaponry. Far less than I do. But then again, I rely far more on shields than I do on armor, unlike them. The Council has met to discuss your growing military might, Hume, and we are impressed with your resilience. That's a code word for, we are scared and will give something up if you threaten us. Oh, you have artifacts. Threatening. Well played, human, you force our hand. Take your winnings and leave us. <laughs> Aww. Quadrazin are stronger than me militarily. Curious. Who's weaker? The wolf ran. <laughs> uh, quantum lathe. Grr, take your scraps. <laughs> Aww. Let's watch what happens once one of those reactors goes, eh? And it's... Come on, get through. Yes, yes. We're hitting the reactors from that side. Yes. What? It was our turn. We got, you got the last one, even though we called it. And then you went ahead and colonized Niels. This is really unfair and beginning to think you don't respect us. Darling, I took that from my enemies. Up. Yep. See, all of those reactors suddenly went. Boom. Like that. Just like that, cause... You know. Stuff like that happens. Let's just send these on to, well, here. They'll have to resupply eventually, but I think we're good for... Is that still Opteris? It can't be, can it? No, no way. Where is there an Opteris presence? It oh, you fracker! If you colonize that, we're gonna have a real problem, you little fucker. Oh, but that's already mine. You can't colonize that, can you? I hope you can't. If you can somehow colonize that, I'll be really angry. Okay, let's see. So, industrial. Go for it. Opteris and Popes who made peace. Planetary shielding. Shift in orbit, but that does not affect me. Don't care, don't care. Fair enough. So yeah, what we can do now is just bomb everyone into non-existence. We just need to put the right kind of weapons on the stuff. And the world there is already getting bombed as well. In fact, what we can do is we can move on to Opteris Homeworld. Right here, Opteris 3. Let's go and have a talk. <laughs> and our money is in the negatives. I wonder why. Could it have anything to do with all these ships? No. Psst. Just finish them off. Yes, bombard, bombard, bombard. Boom! Whoa! Cancel, cancel, cancel. That's good enough. You did well. You did real good, princess. You did real good. 
Ho. And they actually have some sort of a fleet there. Isn't that precious? They actually have a base there as well. Oh my. And it's getting shot at using just basic fighters. You target that. Actually, let's see what's inside there. And we blew out... Oh, it's just storage stuff and some reactors and... Huh. Interesting. Colonize that. I mean, it sucks, but... As a planet, it sucks, but... Uh, even so, it's... Probably would be good to have it. And all their ships appear to be right there. And there quite, seems to be quite a few of them. This may be, in fact, a major... Oh, hyperspace flux. Uncool game. Uncool. Right, at this point, I'm just gonna try and... I'm not gonna bother with ground invasions. I'm just gonna kill everything. And then I'm gonna... Bomb everything. One by one. I think the Wolfren, since they're assholes, are gonna be next. Yes. Take the scraps left behind by your betters. Or maybe the Cordrazine. The Cordrazine are actually growing strong enough to be a problem. <laughs> no. The polyps really want to seize what is mine here. Why is that still considered partially theirs? I don't get it. I mean, what the fuck? Why? Why is that considered partially theirs? That's the second fleet. Who need to move to Opteris. Prime. Oh, hello. Oh, that is so not good. Yes, the hyperspace flux is gone. Strike fast, strike hard. Get in there, capital ships. I need you. And we have two of these now. We have two of these. Jump! Jump! Yes, right there. Okay, we have two of our main ships there. They can't really hurt my shielding there. Just gonna... Yeah, those canopy shields, they make a difference. You should be facing the enemy directly. That's your thing. Not making attack runs, facing them directly. I'll need to correct that with the next design. And I'm not researching anything anymore. Actually, let's max out this stuff. Might as well make use of that. Okay, so one of their reactors blew apparently. Or was that a shield generator? I can't tell. Probably a shield generator because then... Yeah, this is the same design and they have a shield generator in that spot. Ooh, that was a nice hit. Boom. Yup. There goes the ship. The reactor's blue. Chain reaction. That one is slightly damaged. Did this reactor blow? I think not, just it... Yep, now it blew. Oh, those beams are doing a lot of damage. Wonderful, just precious. I'll need to turn the graf graphics down a little bit for future videos, but... Oh, sweet. We are slowly reaching the point where nobody dares to screw with us. And I like that. I like that a lot.
And those are... Well, they're not the tiniest ships either, so... Oh... Just precious. I would say that I'm winning. All of you are on the right attack type. Okay. First fleet, concentrate your firepower on their cruiser. And you can see the shield sort of forming a circle there. That's cause, well, that's just that shi one shield generator defending that spot. That's it. Damn, they have a lot of powerful front armor there. That's their cannons. That's a lot of my tech being finished. Second fleet, engage their home world. Are they shooting back at me? I think they might be, but... Actually, let's see. Yep, they have a missile thing, I think. Just nasty of them. That's a razor. Yes, hit it with your main gun. And these double ancient shields, I mean, oh, that's a plenty of defensive power right there. Even though that particular razor is kind of screwed, because he's between several enemies. I think the main enemy ship already blew, their cruiser that is. But... There's still plenty of stuff to kill. Wow, this is so cool. Epic battle ensues. That one still has its shields, but... I don't think they're gonna last for long. Yep, reactor, boom! And that blew pretty much everything that was left. New cruiser warping in, that's cause enough for killing things. Bombard, bombard, just keep bombarding. Just bomb it. Keep bombing it. Just keep bombing it. Boom! And bring that popul... Wow, they breed fast, huh? Oh. Let's wait until they... One of the main reactors gets hit and then... I mean, one of those behind the two bridges there. Yes, one more hit from this side. Oh, there we go. Boom, there goes the reactor and there goes the ship. Yeah, that... That's it. Boom. And it's gone. Out of commission. So... I bet they would be quite willing to have some sort of peace treaty at this point. Hehehe. <laughs> but... Peace treaties. Psst. Most of the stuff they have here has been killed. Just keep... Yes, just kill everything on there. Kill everything. Just bomb it all. Bomb it all. There's always the possibility of... Uh, just like sending in troops at this point. Actually, yes, I would like to keep the population, so... I'm gonna send in some troops.
That's what we'll do. We'll send in some few troops. Shouldn't take too many. Build a few more to defend Kothar since it's a pretty damn good planet. And meanwhile, the Kodrazine are taking more stuff. Jesus, those assholes are dangerous as fuck. Are you... I hope you're not still bombing. You're not. No, you're not. Excellent. Alright. Oh, are you gonna beat me to it? Well, cr screw you. Is that how it is? <laughs> screw you. I'm taking your worlds now. Give it to me or die. <laughs> oh, I want Silot as well. Yes, you win or you die. So, Silot 4. Ah, they actually defied me. So, yeah, I like them. Not stupid at all. They know the demands will never end. If they keep giving in to them, so... Ooh, most of those tiny ones got owned. Huh. Four and build the rest. Requisition... Yep, and more fighters. There we go. Yeah, in order to really do damage, you kind of need some of the heavier weaponry and fighters, and eh, not so much for that. It's like you don't even care that polyps need worlds to just a bunch of ruthless <laughs> savages. <laughs> oh. I know, it's hard to be a plant person. It's so very hard. <laughs> oh, so sad. <laughs> All right. No, 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 I don't want you to do that. Don't bomb it. I don't want you to actually bomb it. Oh, Opteris Warrior. Kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it with fire before it can land. Boom, yes, boom, boom, boom. Yes, excellent. No landings for you, darling. No landings for... Holy crap, 90 science? Wow, epic. Simulation, sure. So, contact. Negotiate, no, discuss. How about a federation? Ah, so they would join, but... I'm at war with the Opteris and they don't like that. So if I wiped out the Opteris, dot, 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 different rules may apply. Kill it. Kill it, kill it, kill it quickly. Yes, missiles too. Boom! Excellent. No, actually no, just park here. Do I have any troops nearby? Holy crap, they have built quite a few things there now. Okay, bomb it now. You may now bomb it. Where are those troops? There they are, moving real slow like too. For third in military. Third? How the fuck am I third? With all the ships I have. With all the... Seriously, I'm third? Wow. Maybe I should make fewer fighters and more capital ships, you know, like real stuff. I 
Hello, we have a problem. Let's see. Yep, we'll wear down his shields and we'll get at him, but... Oh, hello. Heavy weaponry for the win, huh? Oh, and there goes the reactors. Boom! <laughs> and did you see that his shields were nearly full, too? That's just because he got hit and hit hard from, well, the same side. Like, a lot. Damn. Epicness. Just epicness. Huh. Colonize that. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> no. Just no. Yeah, it kind of sucks to be them at this point, huh? Do I finally have... No, I still don't have troops in there. Where are my troops? I want to end this video on capturing Opteris 3. Still on their way. Yeah, I'm gonna try and turn down the graphics settings on the next one. Just to make sure that... Uh, we can... see what's going on. You know? Really see it. Ooh, and remnant computing. In fact, we can move this up. Because that will give us access to a special event which should be fun. I think I can do that mission for those of you who know what's going to happen. I should have enough fleets. Okay, getting hit from the front where the armor is strongest, but damn, that's loud. Yeah, not the best hit. The vulnerable spot is really here from the side, but... Yes, right there. Hit that reactor. Boom! Boom. Medium freighter, remnant computing, inertial dampeners. Still not there, eh? Okay, there we go. Just get in there. And I have once again built one of those outpost things. Come on, you are in orbit right now, aren't you? You have got to be in orbit, right? Yes. There we go. Opteris 3 is now ours. Boom. So what we want to do here is quickly build up a shipyard and an outpost, of course. Uh, sorry, spaceport, so that we can rearm our ships here. No, manual. Actually, core will do. Yes. Wow, and they have no fertility here. None. Interesting. Okay, we have built the remnant detection array. Your quest to discover the secrets of the remnant continues. It appears that your scientist series are correct upon activating the remnant detection array. They immediately identified an anomalous subspace data stream that is as far as they can tell, coming from everywhere at once and nowhere in particular. With its omnipresent quality, the data stream bears a remarkable similarity to the universal background radiation detectable with normal radio telescopes. The signal strength is equal in all directions and extremely faint. Nothing is... No... Nothing in the known remnant ships would be capable of detecting this signal. However, the array has detected a second, more conventional subspace signal. Analysis suggests that this is an amplified version of the fainter signal and that it is originating inside our galaxy. The location 
of the remnant signal is now revealed. If we wish to learn more, we will need to find it and see what secrets it holds. A silver 4. Okay, so planet list according to system in descending order a silver and where a silver 4. So I'm colonizing that, so that is in this direction somewhere, I think. No? Let's just... Ah, here it is. And this is the thingy. We'll need to build up some pretty significant oomph if we're gonna do this, but we should be able to handle it just fine. We're gonna need a few more spider tanks. No, we don't need that. But... We we'll leave that particular attraction for next time. I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you all for watching and make sure to leave your comments. So, see you all next time.